What's that? Those northerners want to take our land? I am afraid that is true. The brutes of Shu are patiently waiting for an opportunity to attack our kingdom of Wei. But what they are worried about when they do attack is you. They're afraid attacking us in the north will leave them open to an invasion from you from the south. Naturally, their next thought is to eliminate that possibility by eliminating the threat here in Nanjong. I won't let anyone lay a finger on my beloved Nanjong. Jurong. She was the wife of Meng Huo, the king of Nanjong, who ruled over the territory to the south of Shu. She was a fierce warrior who claimed to be a descendant of the legendary god of fire, Jurong. It was the time of the three kingdoms of Wei, Wu, and Shu. One day, a Wei messenger came to see Meng Huo. The shadow of war was about to be cast upon Jurong and the land of Nanjong. And neither you should. That is where we can help you out. We share an enemy, the invading hordes of Shu. We are happy to work together to see off this terrible foe. Yeah, that sounds good. Thanks. Help us out while I show those arrogant northerners the true strength of the king of Nanjong. Great king. It has finally been decided that Wei will launch a preemptive strike against Shu. We will attack on five fronts and end the kingdom of Shu for good. We would like you to be in charge of one of those five fronts, Great King. One of the five? I'm not sure I know exactly what you mean. But basically, you want me to beat the living daylights out of the Shu forces, right? Basically, yes. It would suit us very nicely if you could do that. Uh, excuse me. I mean, if you could cooperate with us, it would certainly contribute greatly to the future peace of the Nanjong region. If you will excuse me, I must be getting back. Sure. Say hi to Cao Pi and the others for me. Huh? What's the matter, dear? Something doesn't smell right about that guy. It's all in your mind, my dear. Don't worry about it. All we have to worry about is keeping Nanjong safe. Yes, you're right. I don't care if it's Shu or whoever. Anyone who tries to hurt my family will be taught a serious lesson. Nanjong is our land. There's no way I'll let you anywhere near it. Let's hit them before they have a chance to strike at us.
do you want? As you can see, I'm feeling pretty unwell. I can't lead troops like this. Sorry, but please just let me rest. Medicine, thank you for your co concern. I'll heal up as best I can then. Yes, thank you for your kindness. What, what do you want? As you can see, I'm feeling pretty unwell. I can't lead troops like this. Sorry, but please just let me rest. You think I'm feigning illness? Never! Please, I simply can't march! I'm sorry, but please, just leave me be. I can't do a thing at the moment. What? What do you want? I can't lead troops like this. Madison. You want to watch me drink it? Why would you want to do that? Could this be poison? You don't need someone who would feign illness? Ah! You know what? I suddenly feel a lot better. I don't need this medicine. Fear not! I will march your way! I love it when things go smoothly like this. Everyone, to defend this area. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. Baby Castle lies along the path Ooh will need to send their reinforcements. I would like to take it without too many casualties. Huh. You're getting a bit too cocky, if you ask me. We won't be handing this place over to you that easily. We have to seize this place and make our preparations. Not least to work out what it is that Ooh really wants. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't keep the castle safe. I don't think I'll ever be a match for my father or my brother. Yet another enemy officer engulfed in the flames of my people. A tremendous display of might and bravery. Another enemy officer. 
officer engulfed in the flames of my people. Wow, you have that certain aura that surrounds great warriors. I so wanted to show Guan Suo what I could do. Sorry. We cannot afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. God of War. <laughs> Yet another enemy officer engulfed in the flames of my people. A tremendous display of might and bravery. Why must I be so weak? Why can't I be more like my father and my brother? Okay, I've managed to secure a path for our advance. Now we just need to wait for the U army to arrive. Report! U reinforcements have arrived! Hmm, the reinforcements are much smaller than I was expecting. I suppose it reveals U's true attitude towards the situation. <laughs> I come from the God of Fire. Our victory was assured. Wow, you have that certain aura that surrounds great warriors. this area. Please, you must retreat. It will be in your own best interests. Who reinforcements? have reached Shangdu, but there aren't many of them. <laughs> U's true intentions have revealed themselves. They're likely to join forces with Shu once more before long. So we've discovered U's true intent. So what? To those numbers, information will make no difference. Not the most worthy of opponents. I would hope you are willing to look past that. I need 
everyone to defend this area. Oh, I'm getting fired up! Oh, dear. I can't help but feel that you are making a terrible mistake. All is proceeding according to my calculations. You have already been surrounded. What? Enemies? What's going on? strategy, Master Mongul. What? So you're saying I lost to a man who used his head? Is that what you're saying? Well then, why don't you go ahead and finish us off? You could have done that at any time, am I right? <laughs> because that is not really what we were after. You kings of the South were merely being misled and controlled by Master Sao Destroying you as an enemy would go against everything that my former Lord Liu Bei stood for. I can't say I really understand what you mean, but I just know I owe you one. How you choose to respond is entirely up to you. So, please go now. What are you called? I am the Prime Minister, Zhugo Liang of Shu. I won't forget that name. Next time you'll see! Ruffians got the better of us. Uh, but that was only because they had the territorial advantage. They just got lucky. There's no way I could ever lose to a man like that. He's all brain, no brawn. Come to think of it, my dear, Jugo Liang said that Wei had fooled us. I don't know who these people think they are. It looks like Wei and Shu both want to make us angry. They're trying to make fools of us, Great King. It's not right. I agree. This is an insult to our intelligence. If they think they can trick us and hurt us, then they'll soon see how wrong they are. Baby. Wow, you have that certain aura that surrounds great warriors. Listen, my dear. Don't you think we ought to scout out what's happening in the Shu ranks? Why would you want to do that? so that we win when they attack. It's always easier if you know what the enemy is going to throw at you. I see. If we have good information, we won't get fooled by liars like those way tricksters. Great thinking, my dear. Let's go right now. 
Wait a minute. It's far too dangerous for you to just head off to Shu. If something were to happen to the two of you, the people of Nanjong would be devastated. <laughs> Don't worry. We won't be so easily defeated. So, now that that's settled, it's time to pummel our way into Shu's stronghold of Janyang! <laughs>